Hey everyone, MTAST here, and I made some mistakes early on in Genshin Impact that I really regret and I'm really paying for now. Now, I've paid quite a bit of money in this game, and I've got some 5-star characters, but I could have had much more. For free. I also could have had much stronger characters. I have a bunch of average jack-of-all-trades characters that are, are trash tier because of one mistake I made early on. And I want to talk about this. I want to talk about this. I've talked about it in other videos, but I really want to showcase it because I am running into this now and I don't want you to quote unquote ruin your account. And I want to explain how I've essentially locked myself into one of the slowest grinds ever because I wasted so many damn materials. Let's get started. I've spent so many materials leveling up and ascending all these different bows. This is my main bow, but I've got a better bow right here. And I literally can't ascend it because I don't have the material and I gotta wait a day to get it or, or I had to wait to get my my resin to farm it and if you're trying to level up all your characters and get all of them different weapons I have wasted so many materials because in many cases these materials are shared and so if I now go back out and I look we've got a weapon here that's you know I'm trying to enhance. I've got this weapon, I got this weapon, I got this one, this weapon, I got this one, this one, this one. I have so many weapons that I have ascended and I've leveled up and I've enhanced. I'm running out of materials. I've got no materials. I can't get any upgrades for my main characters, my main DPS characters that I want to get the upgrades on, I can't. And because I've done it on so many people that I don't even use in my main party, like, even just Razor. Razor is awesome, but he's not my main guy. I've leveled him up, I've ascended him a couple times, I've wasted so much resin, I've wasted so many materials, that now my main characters are suffering. My main team of characters are suffering. And I can't ascend a couple. Uh, I, I need to wait for more resin, I need to farm more resin uh, uh, locations. I'm running out of money, okay? I'm running out of everything! The biggest one, is experience. I literally don't have enough experience to level up my characters. This, I got one of these. I got I got 10 of these. I got no experience for my characters. So even if I wanted to get a, a character from level 50 to 60, or from 60 to God forbid 70, well, there's no chance. I, I can't even come close because I've wasted 20 of them on one character, 40 on another, 70 on another. I could have a cracked out Tier 70, everyone's level 70 team. Everyone has level 70 weapons. I could have had that. I could have had the best team ever. But now I've got a couple of 70s and a bunch of 50s. And the 50 characters, especially in the Spiral Abyss, they're getting one hit. They're getting absolutely demolished. They're not doing anything. I use them for elements. That's great. And you know, it, it's, it's great to focus on one or two characters, especially if you're a free-to-play player. But... You know, even better, it's like, all right, you got your first two done, now do four. You got your first four done, now do six. You got to do this in stages because if you're like trying to go all the way across the board, everyone's going to be average, everyone's going to be trash. And, uh, you know, I've never really played a gotcha game like this. I didn't realize the impact of this. I didn't realize how much this would actually uh, impact me. Now, I'm not going to be blowing a bunch of money to, to buy experience and things like that. I, I, I buy characters, I, I roll for characters, I've got some really good weapons and stuff, but I don't wanna be like spending to get all the experience available because I, I feel like that's just a little excessive. But man, I, I, I'm really tilted here. I'm, re I'm really tilted here and I don't want you to make this mistake. And it goes with everything. It's your ability upgrade materials, your talent level ups. Talent level ups get very, very expensive. And you're going to have a bunch of these. But if you're using the same character, you can see my ballad ones. I've got, I've got one green ballad. And I've got like 35 of this. I got 16 of these, but I don't use any characters that use these. And so I am sitting here. I didn't farm enough of the ones that I actually needed. And I literally can't even upgrade my talents. One of the biggest boosts, because everything scales off your talents. If your scales, or if your talents are level one, You've got no damage on your talents. You're not going to do any damage. And my top tier best characters, I can't even give them the highest level talents because I wasted getting, uh, you know, random characters that are are not even auto attacking. Better auto attacks, 
right? I, I gave Venti a bunch of these for his auto attack, and I never auto attack with him. I use him for abilities. That's all I do. I pop him out, he uses his abilities, and he's done. That's it. And I've wasted so many materials doing that because I'm just stupid. <laughs> I'm just not really thinking. And I don't want my audience to do that. There's so many materials in the game and, and some of them that maybe you're not using as much, you might amass a bunch of them. But brothers, you gotta get on this. Now I have 120 out of 120 resin, okay? Never do this. If you have 120, 120 resin, it is not recharging. You need to spend this immediately. I left this overnight just so I could put this in a video and I hate myself because I know that it's not optimal. You need, you need to be spending this resin on domains, farming for these materials, even if you're getting the blues and greens, even if you're getting down to your talent materials um, for, for lower level talents. This one right here, this is one of the ones I need. I need this for ka -ching, okay? Just farm them because you can always upgrade them and alchemize them higher. Same thing goes with these bosses. Brothers, hunt these bosses. I've shown this again, like multiple times in these videos. These don't require any resin, but the materials they need, you need a ton of them. My ka character needed like, I think it was in the realm of about a hundred of these, a hundred of the, the green ones. So you can farm these ones, you can send them up, but I needed like a hundred of these. Now I'm starting to get the blue ones. You need hundreds of them at level 70. If you're getting to level 80, boys, if you're not doing this as kind of like a daily project, not 24 seven, have fun, explore. But if you do not hunt these bosses and one of the characters that you get, one of these five star characters you finally get that you like to play, you will not be able to upgrade them, and it's going to take you days. It's going to take you days of hunting. You're going to have a couple points here and there. You're going to have a couple little sweet little nectars, but you're not going to have a hundred nectars. You didn't kill a hundred flowers, and it could be any of the bosses, really. There's so many of them in the game, like maybe you didn't kill these guys. Maybe you didn't kill enough rune guards. I don't know. Maybe you saw rune guards running around, and you ran away because they're scary. Well, guess what? You got a character that needs a freaking 90 of these. Oh, I feel like I've almost ruined my account in some ways. I'm still doing good. I've still got some stuff I can do and I really got to get grinding. And do you want to know what? Do you know what my biggest regret was? Is not re-rolling. I didn't know what re-rolling was and maybe you don't know what re-rolling is, but if you get your account level to level seven, you get like, 40 summons or so about 40 45 summons and if you get to level 10 i think you, you get even a little bit more and i summoned uh, at the very start of the game because said hey you've got wishes available i just did it and i got some pretty bad characters and i got a lot of repeat characters of barbara i got a bunch of noels i got characters that i don't i don't really use at all and i wish i would have re-rolled for some other stronger characters at the very start i wish i would have just made a couple accounts got maybe one five star and then started from there because I hit the pity timer multiple times and I spent money. I, I spent a thousand dollars and I do start getting five, you know, I've got some five star characters now, but there's people that are free to play players that have better accounts than I do. They've got better casts of characters than I do because over the course of finding all the chests, all the level ups, you actually do get quite a few wishes. You get enough wishes for, for multiple five star characters. And so if you re-roll your account and you get really lucky on those first few wishes and you've essentially reset that pity timer, Chances are you can get three or four five-star characters without even having to spend money. I'm telling you, I'm not, I'm not memeing. I'm not like, oh yeah, like, I'm telling you, if you re-roll your character, if you're like level 10, if you're level 15, I know you missed out on some progress, but if you don't have any five-star characters, you could literally just make a new account, re-roll it, and, it, and if you get a five-star character really early on, like in your first couple of wishes, you're golden. You, you have set yourself up for success. You could essentially save yourself like 90 wishes, depending on your luck. If you get one in those first few wishes that you do, you have set your account on a course of success. Because even if you get a repeat of a five-star character, you're winning. If you get a, a top-tier DPS, if you get one of the best supports or one of the best healers, five-starred, you have literally made your account better than the average person by a long shot because it is rare to get five star characters. And so if you can use free wishes that are super easy to get, it takes like 30 minutes to make a new account, do it. I mean, I've spent the money, I'm committed, but I honestly, I might make a free to play account to show how cracked of a team you can get 
by re-rolling and, and then just playing the game and getting all the chests. Because I, I play this game full time, it's my job, right? Like, it is what it is. I, I might do that just to show how nutty you can make a free to play team. And if you're smart with your resources, how much better. I could probably pass this account free to play. Even though I've spent a thousand dollars. Because of the things I know now. Because of the things I'm telling you. I would be at a better spot. I would have more smooth level ups. I messed up. I messed up real bad. Don't make these mistakes. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you soon, my friends. Bye-bye. This just in, MTashed Mango Splash is coming back in stock, and you can pre-order it right now. This is the best energy drink on the market. If you guys want to support the Tash Man, go to advanced.gg slash MTashed and use code MTashed for 10% off your drink today.